all right today i'm finna rank all the point guards in the nba today you know what i'm saying the starting point guards i don't even think there's a tier list that has literally every single point guard of the nba that has played point guard this season i'm not finna make no dmp list i see you know what i'm saying john Morant lost but i'm not making no dmp list i'm gonna just go off the most recent play the most recent play and we're gonna roll from there i'm not gonna lie some of these people i'm gonna have to pull out the freaking basketball reference i got it in the tuck right here you know what i'm saying i got it in the tuck search up anybody so without further ado let's start with devin booker now devin booker i ain't gonna lie i ain't gonna lie bruh if I, if we're being honest if we're being real you gotta put him in a depending on how the list rest of the list shakes up i might have to but i might i might you know what i'm saying but for now i'm gonna put him in a because he's right there boys averaging like 28 and 9 or something like that playing with kd playing with well i guess he hasn't really played with Bill, but yeah he's do, he's literally doing his thing bro like the whole discussion around the suns was oh they have no point guard they have no playmaking offense is not the problem for the team i've been knew the offense is not going to be a problem for that team even i didn't think he was going to be this good of a point guard immediately you know what i'm saying so the passing acumen is there i feel like you got to give him his props so yeah the d-book right there cj from what i've seen him play he's kind of he's i like he's not bad he's not bad i might have to check the stats too but like i think like the stats is going to reflect that too like cj mccollum shout out to him coming back from that that lung injury golly this played like ass but yeah he's playing like he's not even getting assists like that but he's not getting turnovers either the turnover assist to turnover ratio is much lower than it was last season like he's getting his buckets on mid efficiency 51 percent not not great not terrible but not very good either he get uh, some cool little assists you know what i'm saying and from what i've actually seen him play like he can pass but he's not really a point he's a shooting guard that has had to play the point guard for that position to optimize the rest of the roster so he's all right like he's not bad he's cool I guess you know what i'm saying he's cool mm, i might low-key put him in c because i feel like the b tier is gonna have some niggas in there bro because it i feel like if d book is a tier he might be like he's probably might be around here considering the, the rest of the list i'm gonna go through you know what i'm saying colin sexton i'm gonna put him in c tier i'm definitely gonna take him that's my i don't know what that man had been doing this season but from what i seen last season it wasn't hooping like that got 12 points three assists two of turnovers 50 percent effective field goal percentage you know what i'm saying obviously he's playing off the bench wait no yeah he's, he's coming off the bench so it's like is he really a starter caliber point guard if he's coming off the bench who's the point guard for that team uh it's keontae george isn't it yeah because the rookie so if they should put keontae george here i'd honestly put go like this yeah i think this is this this makes sense i think this is good i think this is fine because he's still even though he's not getting that many assists, he's still producing so uh, yeah i'll put him in that that kind of role Cade. Okay, I don't even have to go to basketball reference. I, I see his numbers, bro. He's playing with I don't even I want I don't even know if it's one of the worst teams ever, but it's like definitely down there, bro. Like 19 game losing streak. It's not his fault. He has no spacing, he has no help, bro. But he's his numbers is kind of ass. Not ass, but his numbers are not very good, bro. But I, mean, I, I know what he's capable of, but it's just the turnovers, and you know what I'm saying. He definitely has a lot of potential, but it's like I can't put him with Sexton. I think this is like, yeah, the perfect tier for just like plus. Yeah, mid plus. This is just like straight mid. It's just like mid plus. Mid plus. Good to mid plus. A very, very good on that on that on that big tier in the S is like okay, best in the league. And Indy Book is right up there with the best in the league. And I, I want to put him quite up there, but he, he up there though. He really up there. Curry S tier. Hope you know to talk about it. Dame <laughs> Dame A tier. And to be honest, he's closer to B tier than A tier at this point, bro. Like he not hoping like that, bro. <laughs> He's so wishy-washy right now, bro. So one game will give you that 30, you know what I'm saying? Like six, seven, three, eight threes a night. The other game, he'll throw like seven out of 20. So it's like, I'm gonna put him in A tier because we know who Dave is. And he hasn't been playing completely. He's he's actually picked up the pace like recently. Yeah, the 20, okay, yucks. But like he had the eight out of 13, 10 out of 16, 10 out of 16. Uh, nine at 18 oh gosh he shot terribly from three that game but like yeah like look at the three-point shooting 44 percent 71 percent 50 percent 44 percent like he's picking up the pace he's getting assists that that two-man action with Giannis is working well 25.6 on 43 35 51 percent effective field yeah he has around the same effective field goal percentage as like uh as cj kate is like the, the, the one of the lowest efficiency on his team which is unfortunate but it's not his fault but it is what it is uh you look at the number you know what i'm saying seven assists 2.8 turnovers good ratio three point shooting it's coming back it was it was on this 35 percent is a much greater it, he was like 28 percent before 30 percent before so the fact that he's at 36 percent before means that he's going back up to this kind of form 
yeah with dame i'm gonna still put him in the a tier even though i will say there's a, there's some there's definitely separation between him and Devin, but i'll put him in that a tier for now he's also wishy-washy i might put him with sexton though hold on right i feel like i feel like so casual just looking up everybody's numbers but it's just because some people they the numbers don't even match their play for real yeah six six, six 17 points per game 7 percent fill efg you know what i'm saying 40 from three what are the higher years uh 6.3 assists 1.8 turnovers and watch a game play he gets hot he also some can make some bad decisions but he gets hot and like his like his, his number is actually pretty good like he's, he's very efficient yeah he he's actually played better for la than for the timberwolves but like even like there was that one time with the timberwolves he was actually kind of hooping and then then he wasn't so it's like i don't even know with d-lo bruh like with d-lo i don't even know bruh like look at look, look at these games bruh 35 crazy efficiency 16 pretty good efficiency nine eight you know what i'm saying and then you got 14 and a good efficiency so it's like with d-lo it's just like i don't even know <laughs> d-lo i think i think i'm gonna put him here eh, i'm gonna put him i think i think right there is good mid plus Right that mid plus so I, i'll put him like mid minus dg the pg i'm gonna put him right here off the strength i'm gonna look at the numbers though i'm gonna still look at the numbers i'm gonna still look at the numbers but from what i've seen he's not playing that nice okay never mind the number is actually better than i thought because like he was having some bad games bro and like he can't play good next to demish like that bro like or him and demish are a weird fit surprisingly but like yeah looking at like 19 points per game the three-point shot fell off a little bit i know that for a fact but he was shooting like 28 percent before so like <laughs> you know what i'm saying improvement 47 <laughs> percent from the field the career high actually he throws shooting assist turnover ratio is not good or compared to last season and he 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 had some terrible he had like eight turnovers the other game bro i don't even remember when but he had a lot of turnovers the other game bro i mean he's he's relatively the same guy he was last it's just a three-point shooting do I want to put him in the same tier as D'Lo? I feel like he's better than D'Lo for sure. This is the tier where it's kind of just like, I'm, I get confused. Bro. Do I want to give K the benefit of the doubt? I feel like I want to give K the benefit of the doubt. D'Lo been hoping this season. That's the thing. I can't, I feel like I can't put him with Sexton. But I don't want to put Sexton in D tier. You know what I'm saying? Decisions, decisions, decisions. Maybe I just move D-Book up. I think I move D-Book up. Yeah, let me just move D-Book up. Let me move D-Book up. Let me move D, keep DG here. Derek White, I don't know. Nothing about Derek White numbers, bro. He was hooping last season. What's he doing this season? Let's see. I know he, uh, he I had a feeling he was hooping. He's hooping, the Celtics are hooping. I haven't watched a single Celtics game this season, but they're hooping. They're like the best team in the league. So like, I'm gonna just pull like that. Luca, uh, not too much. Aaron Fox, not too much. Fred Van Vliet. Van Vliet's kind of playing this season, bruh. He's kind of hooping this season. I'm not gonna lie. Fred Van Vliet, from what I've seen in the numbers wise, he's not shooting terrible okay never mind i was gonna say he's not shooting terribly at the rim i guess he's still shooting terribly at the rim but his <laughs> three-point shot he's the three-point shot is there the assist that boy be getting assists like crazy it's so weird because like you look at the three-point shot it's like oh 40 percent 43 percent some percent like he's he's shooting damn he's shooting and you look at the rest of the numbers and it's like he can't he's so inefficient so it's kind of crazy i think it's the on-court value i don't know what type of defense he's playing but for what i see he getting them assists you know what i'm saying he getting them assists one way or another do i put him up here because i mean the rockets are i feel like i gotta reward the rockets for being good you know what i'm saying or her not to being terrible but like but, but cade getting pistons tax right now i'll keep it right here tyrus oliver not too much jaw i'll put him right here he hasn't played this season from what we've seen last season he goes right here jalen brunson he been i he been i he ain't been that nice this season bro right am i tripping he been on a slow start, right? Because he's he's had a slow start this season. Niggas told me he was better than Tyrese. They lied. Or he's actually playing around the same, but just slightly less efficient from the field. You look at the assist totals, the assist is not there. But Julius Randle been doing his thing a little bit. He's been doing his thing a little bit. RJ has an improvement too. So he's playing about the same. And he was like right there last year. Let me look at RJ's numbers just to verify what I'm saying, bro. RJ 19, slightly more fit. Never mind. Like, it, but the three point is slightly better, but like, yeah, he's basically the same. Actually, now I think about it, he's actually basically the same player he was last season. I thought he was hooping. I mean, yeah, the move 23. Oh, yuck, yucky, 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 yucky. What happened? I, he, I thought he was hooping. Anyway, Jalen Brunson basically the same. He's having some bangers here and there, but he's basically the same player he was last year. And that was like right here. And Tyrese, Tyrese was like right here. 
the air fox was like floating ah the air fox was like floating around well no the air fox was like here now tyrese is up here you know what i'm saying dame was like dame was yeah dame was like around here now he's playing like this DRG was around here Charles was around here jay was out here so they really just got leapfrogged by their peers speaking of their peers s tier is kind of busting right now so i feel like i might have to make some adjustments i don't know so mvp candidates in this tier jamal murray he been good this season he ain't been amazing but like he, he, I, I feel he just i'm not even gonna let the stats bro he he contributes to winning on a level that we've already seen you know what i'm saying in the final and we and you see it like they just lost their the first game of the season where Jokic, jamal murray and michael Porter jr were on the court thanks to favorite elite so and the rockets so like when him Jokic, and mpj are on the court they 90 percent of the time they just don't lose so i'm gonna just put him right i'm gonna put give him his respect i think he's been playing better than pretty much all these guys yeah i think that's it <laughs> so, Harden, he been playing like this, bruh. He been playing like this. He's good. Is he better than these guys? I'm just gonna say no. I'm just gonna say no, bruh. Like, nah, bruh. He's got, what, 14 points per game, bruh? Nah. Nah. Nah, bruh. Like, he's too mushy with the... I mean, he, he's picking it back up. He's definitely picking it back up. But that start of the season was so gross, bruh. It was so nasty that I'm gonna just have to... I'm gonna have to tax him until further notice. I'm gonna have to tax him. Jordan Poole, D tier. No, not... I don't have that much to say. I'm not even gonna post the stats because we know what the stats are. <laughs> the stats are bad. <laughs> you can't score on the Wizards, bruh. You can't score on the Wizards with the green light. Now he's not even getting as many minutes because they're always getting blown out. Like, yucky, yucky, nasty business. Drew Holiday, the C tier is kind of not. C tier is coming. C tier is coming all the way. Drew Holiday, keep doing his thug this one. I have actually not even looked at his stats so far. I haven't even looked at his stats so far, bruh. He can't. I haven't even looked at his stats. Yeah, mid ass stats. The offense is not there. We knew that for a fact already. The defense, it kind of regressed. We know that. I don't even have to look at the steals to know that. But oh, apparently he's rebounding more. Okay, I guess so. The assist turn ratio, not get as many. But he, he's playing with Tatum and, and um, Derek White and, you know what I'm saying, players. So, like, that's why his assist will go down. Offense efficiency is not there. But I haven't even watched him. I mean, outside of like highlights, I haven't really watched him play like that. So I feel like I want to give him the benefit of it. But I don't know. When you look at the stats, statistically, he's like this, bruh. Statistically, he's like that. So I don't know. I might get cooked in the comment. You know what I'm saying? But I'm going to just put him right here because statistically, bruh, he's not even playing like that, bruh. But I, I don't know if he's some X Games mobile player that, you know what I'm saying? The defense is just immaculate S tier defense. But I don't know about all that because Derek might be a good defender too. So I'm going to, I'm going to, you know what I mean? I'm gonna put him right here. I'm gonna put him right here. I'm gonna keep it pushing. Kyle Lowry. I'm not looking at the stats. I'm putting that nigga right there. Lamelo been hooping his ass off. Lamelo been hooping his ass off, bro. It's tough. They got down with the injury, but he been hooping this season, bro. He been hooping, bro. I'm gonna have to do something here because C tier is not C tier anymore. Uh, I'll, 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 uh, it'll get there. It'll, it'll, get, it'll get there. Lonzo, when he was playing, well, last time he played was actually over a season ago. So like, I'm just, I got a pad numbers. I got a pad number. You haven't played in two seasons. I'm going to just do that. Markel! B tier. I've seen enough. Shout out my neck, Markel. He's a hooper. He's been hooping. Russ, I'll put him in C tier. High C tier. I can't put him in the same tier as Russ because they play similar roles on the same team. And there, there's a reason why Harden gets more minutes. But when he plays, the hustle is there, bro. The hustle is real. Defense is there, honestly. But he also still makes the same toss he turnovers you know bad decision making which is exactly why you, he's a spark plug but then you, people are like oh you know so he only gets this amount of minutes and he gets some he puts in work if you give him more minutes he'll go crazy i'm like bro you have to realize at this point the nigga's a six man like this is literally what a six man is if you give them more minutes they go they're gonna tire out you know what i'm saying the decisions we made that we won't be optimal to the team so that's that's the reason why he's a good six man he puts him some juice on the bench and every single minute he plays you know what i'm saying he's gonna play hard he's gonna do the things so that's that's like what a six man is for anyway we're just staggering his minutes behind it but yeah i'm gonna hold it right there conley conley actually been good this season bro. i ain't gonna lie my conley been playing bro. yeah 11 points 57 look at the efficiency look at the three point percentage 42 percent from three six assists on one turnover like come on bro. he been hoping he been hoping no cap you know what y'all both the niggas mid both of y'all niggas mid both of y'all niggas, niggas down clippers tax all right, Trey Bartholomew Young the third. Um, I'm gonna put him in A tier. Put him in A tier. I think he's been playing better than these guys. 
these guys. Even though the efficiency is nasty gross business, nasty business, nasty business. But he's picking it back. Is he picking it back up? No. Okay, the three-point shot is still is mid. I'll just say it's it's a oh it's slightly below league average, but the per, per the points per game is there. The efficiency is I mean, I guess at this point it's stated because like it's looking like this season and that season were anomalies. Because you look at this season, this season, this season, and this season. Four seasons of all right, good score, kind of inefficient two seasons of great score pretty well, even this efficiency the this 43 percent from the field like like he only had one season 46 percent and all the rest of the seasons one season 53 percent effective field goal percentage and the rest of the seasons is like 50 ish so it's like at this point you know what i'm saying that's kind of who trey is 10 assists four turnovers very very elite assist turnover ratio but it's not better than any of these guys bruh it's not better than any of these guys schroeder he been playing good i'm gonna put him in c tier he been playing he been playing good, but I might have to do that Raptors tax because after Germany, he, he was hooping a little bit. But now I think he, yeah, his numbers kind of went back down. Uh, 13, 15 points per game, 41%, 33, 6.8 assists. You know what I'm saying? Good assist to no ratio, but you, you're going to have to get taxed. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> You'll have to get taxed. Somebody had to go down there, bro. Scoot, I'm going to have to put your ass in D tier, bro. That's tough. That's tragic. That's tragic. It's unfortunate. But that the, the start of the season, disgustingly gross. Now he's finally picking it back up, but like, He's played 12 games in those 12 games. You know what I'm saying? Most recently. Yeah, like, look at that, bruh. <laughs> look at that, bruh. Like, yucky, 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 yucky. Trey Jones. Put your head right there. You know how to pass the ball to Wimby. And so for that, like this. Because you, you're passing the ball to Wimby and you pass it most of the time. Then Wimby, what's the opposite of tax? Bonus. You get the next bonus. You've been, you've been doing your duck dizzle. I'm not even gonna pull up the numbers because I, I know what I see when I see Spencer Dinwiddy on the court. Hey, that boy be hooping some time. Bro. He just fueled that run and made us win the game the other night. So, you know what I'm saying? I'll put him right here. That mid plus. Mid pl Actually, nah, I'm, I'm gonna put him in mid minus, man. I can't put you above, you know, I got the Nets bias, but I can't put you above Markel. I can't put you, I can't do it, man. That's my name, Markel, man. I can't do it. But I think this is a pretty, pretty good, you know what I'm saying? We got the MVP candidates. Like six of them. I'm not. I'm not doing the mid ordering. Y'all can figure out the order. I don't really care. Then we got very, very good point guards. Jaw. Hopefully you can come back and on a few weeks. You know what I'm saying. Save the Grizzlies from. I don't know. Maybe you can make the plan. I don't know. Maybe I don't know, bro. Like it's not looking good for the Grizzlies, bro. You can do something. But I think the tier is pretty good for what it is. Um, this tier, I had to make some decisions. I had to make some some decisions. You know, you could definitely argue. You'd be like, oh, you play this guy. But I was like, nah, no, nah, I'm not doing it. Cause clippers tax and then i'm not doing the piston the pistons tax but also he's a good inefficient you know what i'm saying we got some efficiency woes good for their teams for the teams is doing and then we got markel mike conley hoopers straight point guards then got dimity actually i'm gonna go like this i don't care um try to pass the 1b clippers tax sexton's just ah uh, he's just mid drew holiday mid mid Kyle Lowry fell off again. Lonzo, you don't play. Schroeder is cool. And then we got two of the worst statistical point guards in the league. <laughs> you could definitely mix and match, but I feel like if you vehemently disagree with anything on this list, it's like, bruh, I, I, bruh, I, I, um, that's about it. Subscribe.